Hi everyone, my name is Colina. I'm the, from High Offer Europe and welcome to another edition of Conversations with Teachers. Today I have a special guest from the Philippines and I'll let you introduce yourself. So uh, who, who am I speaking to today, John? Hi, my name is John Glenn. I'm from the Philippines. Uh, mm -hmm. I am 23, 23 years old. Uh -huh. And um, I graduated in college last 2015. Mm -hmm. I am actually a teacher by profession, so I really, you know, I am really familiar with the job. Uh -huh. I, I handle ele elementary students, so yeah, oh, all okay. all general education or general subjects. Oh, okay, uh -huh. okay. So you're in the Philippines. What city are you uh, at now? Oh, I'm from Bacolod City. I call it the city of smiles, right? <laughs> yes, yeah, city of smiles. <laughs> uh, okay. How long have you been teaching English? Oh, um, I've been teaching English for almost three months, oh, just good. English alone. Yeah. But yes, because uh, before I I was working as a call center agent, mm -hmm. so I've been working as a call center for mm -hmm. almost two years too, mm -hmm. and yes. Oh, that's great. So you're, you're just teaching online. Yes. Oh, that's <laughs> wonderful. What, uh, what did you study at university? Oh, I studied in Carlos Salado Memorial State College mm -hmm. here in uh, near Bacolod. Uh -huh. And yeah, it, it took me four years to graduate in education. I, mm -hmm. I did not as well graduate with flying colors, but successfully. Mm -hmm. Right after graduating, I took up the board examination, and yeah. fortunately, I passed the board, and I am an, I am now a licensed teacher. Oh, wow. So that's what you wanted to do. You went to university, and now you're <laughs> doing your best career. Wonderful. Why did you choose to be a teacher? Oh, um... I am actually an observant kind of person. Mm -hmm. So I saw my teachers... In the elementary, back in elementary and in high school, mm -hmm. um, they were like, you know, you, you try to also compare yourself as you grow and you get, get mature. Like, why did my teacher do this? Why did my teacher do that? <laughs> you know, yeah. you try to, oh, I, I could have done this. If, if I were in my teacher's place, this mm -hmm. is what I would do. Or mm -hmm. just, uh, you know, something like, yeah, that that one that that's one thing that pushed me to become a teacher. Mm -hmm. Like, if I were if I will become a teacher, this is what I want to do. I want to be the most patient teacher. Mm -hmm. I want to be the the best role model to my students. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, my teachers before when I was in elementary and high school, they were not you know perfect. I, I know that, that being a teacher is not you cannot be a per perfect teacher, right. but you can be some someone who inspires or oh yeah inspires or affects your students future yeah. influence your students so i want to be someone like that so that's that what pushed me through to become a teacher yeah yeah and that's that's a very it's a it's a great reason to inspire and improve upon the education that you yes. that you receive so um what advice do you have for new, brand new teachers who are considering uh, teaching English as a second language? Mm. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> so, you know what? If I were to give advice to beginners or teachers, people or person who is planning to be a teacher, mm -hmm. which is graduated college, mm -hmm. um, uh, one thing I would remind them is that you need two P's that's passion and patience the two passion because you know in a job mm -hmm. you cannot last very long mm -hmm. if you don't have that passion inside to mm -hmm. give your all because mm -hmm. if you're a passionate kind of person in your job you give your all you know just like if you have a lover right if you have a partner <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you yeah. really love your partner, you would do, give your time, your effort, right. your you know, energy, everything to your lover, right? Yeah. It's just the same yeah. thing with teaching. You yeah. need that passion to mm -hmm. stay longer. 
and patience because yeah. not all of the time that students could would understand or would get right. what you mean right, right? so long patience <laughs> very very long patience okay. yeah. is, is there a particular um like uh, you, you mentioned patience but for online teaching is there a particular skill that that you think somebody must uh, have to do this job well mm, i think communication skills because mm. You know, um, you don't get to see the students all of the time. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So your communication skills mm -hmm. tells or would dictate if the student will learn or not. So mm -hmm. if you're a good um, teacher, if you're a good communicator, so teach, a student would really understand what the class is. Is there something particular you love about your job? Right. Once that student, if once you see that student pro progressed mm -hmm. in the long in the long run, mm -hmm. I think that that makes that that's one thing I love about my job. Mm -hmm. It's seeing that all your effort is, you know, <laughs> you see all the effort, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, all all the effort that you put into the job, you can see your yeah. students exactly. rise in their level. Oh, I see. Yeah. So um, you used the high offer system to find um, your career online. How, how did you come across high offer? Mm. Um, that was actually during my free time. Mm -hmm. I was like surfing or I was like scrolling on my Facebook. Mm -hmm. yeah. I saw Miss Mary Blanche post about high offer. Mm -hmm. I click on it, I read about it, and as well, this, the, the offer is high, so it's, you know, you <laughs> yeah. need to be practical. Well, it's been a pleasure speaking with you about a wow. uh, high offer, about uh, teaching English online. Oh, me too, Kalina. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for your time. And uh, if anybody is interested in becoming an online English teacher, um, look at the information in the description below and we can get you registered just like John and become an online English teacher for us at high offer we also have positions available in China as well so thank you for your time